I'm using the Simpson APB 100-150 adjustable elevator post base to build my paragola. So it comes in two sections, the base which sits on the concrete and the top part which gets screwed in into the post. This is uh, adjustable for one reason that you can screw it in in such a way that you get a height between 100 mm to 150 mm. So the base over there is 130 mm square and the top bit of it is 100 mm square. You can see it on the post over there where it's inverted. So to drive the holes or to drill the holes I'll be using my auger bit which is 8 mm. That would drive these 10 mm coach bolts. These are pre-galvanized zinc so they should stand this corrosion, rust and all that and they get tightened by my socket ratchet anyway. One of the first step to do here is find the exact position on your post where the base should sit in. So to find the center I'm just going to draw the straight lines from one corner to the other and the same thing on the other side and then I would just keep the post base on top of it as you can see over here and just mark the position where the line crosses the circling it so that it's cleanly visible on the video. Now when you're drilling the coach bolts in or the hole for the coach bolts to go in make sure that you tape it up so that you know how much deep you need to go in. Always leave a little bit longer so that it's got space for wood shavings, chips and all that sort of stuff. I've kept all the four post bases on the concrete piers and what I'm planning to do next is make sure that they all align exactly on the string lines. There you can see that I'm just marking the positions where the holes needs to be drilled and now I use my hammer drill and make sure that the holes are drilled straight. To attach these base on the concrete, I'll be using sleeve anchor bolts. So these are 100 mm long and M8 size and I bought this from Screwfix in the UK. So you hammer this thing in the holes and then tighten the nut on the top 
and you make sure that it fits really snug and tight. So hammer the sleeve anchors in straight in. These nuts take a 14mm socket head so what I'm going to do is attach that to my socket ratchet and then make sure that I just go ahead and tighten it up. The only thing that you need to be sure or be careful when you do this is never to over tighten it. If you over tighten it, it will just spin around inside the sleeve and it wouldn't have any holding power. So you need to stop when you feel it just bites in, you know, that is when, just when it's uh, showing, throwing some resistance. It's not budging anywhere. So now we are almost at the end of this project so I just screwing it back into the post base. Now you could get a height between 100mm and 150mm as I mentioned at the start of the video but in my case I don't need any specific height I'm just screwing it in until it's tight and these are sacrificial posts anyway and I'm just doing a test fit. So that's basically how I did this build and if you have any questions leave it down in the comment sections below and I hope this video was useful. So thanks for watching and see you next time.